So, have you called in any favors yet? No, not yet. Why not? We need to build our army. Oh, come now, Skekdai. I may be many things. A monster, a murderer, but I am also lenient. They need about a week to recuperate after what I put them through. Despite the lack of regards for their humanity, it doesn't trouble you to put your former allies through your violent endeavors? Not entirely. But besides, it wasn't all that long ago that we were all at each other's throats. I'm quite pleased to be a part. <laughs> she was right about you. Isn't she always? She was wise to choose you as a mate. Over who? Atrix? That cackling bastard couldn't mate with his head even if he tried. Surprised she hasn't killed him yet. As are we all. <sighs> I'm curious. Why haven't you just killed Sardix yet? What makes him so special? Aside from the fact that he's my brother, he cannot be killed by standard means. And you're not worried about a revolution. You should have seen the look on his face. After I killed his beloved wife, he immediately fell in line. However, Tech and Jackson might be an issue. I'll watch them both very closely. Actually, I have a plan for our dear old Tectonic. Oh? I spoke with her, and she has agreed to take him in if we get him on board. And how would you intend on doing this? No doubt he hates you after what you did. <laughs> Tensions are growing between Sardix and Tech. If we can light the match that starts that fire, Tech will be ours. We do have a way with words. Yes.